or welcome back to my channel. I'm Laura Violet and I'm so happy you're here. So, my July Stitch Fix has arrived Yay! and I wanted to unbox it for all of you. I just moved two weeks ago, so my apartment is a mess. So, um, <clears throat> just ignore whatever might be in the background. I'm so excited about my move, although, when you move, you realize how much you have, as in how many belongings you have. And I do have a lot of clothes, so I probably should not be entertaining this stitch fix, but oh, the lamp on in the background might be annoying. Oh, and there's my backpack. <laughs> this is the box. I think this is actually the smallest stitch fix box I have ever received. And I started in 2018, so it's been about three years now. So I am very interested. Why is the box so small? All right, so when you open it up, you get this cute little envelope. And in here, it's going to have the prices of each item, so I don't wanna look yet because <laughs> I wanna be surprised. And then this cute little pamphlet looking thing gives you ideas on how to style the clothes that are in your box. And it always comes with a little note. It looks like my stylist this time was Rita. And if you read the note, it will probably give away what's in the box because they mentioned like, hey, I thought this dress would be good for you. So I try not to actually read the note until <laughs> I'm done looking at all the pieces. Here is the bag to mail back the items if you don't like any of them. Item number one. Ooh, wow, okay. Wow, wow. Okay, I'm gonna have to stand up. This is a dress that I don't really know what color it is. It's like an orangey pink. Okay, I have to try it on, but I really do like this because first it's by Market and Spruce and I do enjoy their clothes. And sometimes their clothes are a little too plain for my liking, but this is cute because the bottom has this little pattern on it. If you can see which is really nice and I love long sleeve dresses or like half sleeve I mean my I'm pretty short so this might be long sleeves but it the sleeves are cool because they're kind of bigger and then they have the same sort of like cut out that the bottom of the dress has and it seems like it kind of does the little cinch at your waist type of thing because it has this seam. So I'll have to try it on, but yeah, I mean, it will definitely be really long. It's probably supposed to be like a mid-length dress, but because I'm so short, this might actually be the entire height of my body. So we'll see, but I really do like that one. Item number two. Ooh, okay, a little tank top. Okay, okay. So it's blue and then it has some stripes. It's from Lush. And if you can see it has it like ties right here at the bottom. So it's pretty short. Um it, I don't know if it's like cropped. Well, I guess it's supposed to be cropped. I don't know. I'd have to try it on. But it is very cute. It's very thin material, but obviously I would only be wearing this in the summer because it's a summer shirt. Item number three. All right, this is a classic. I feel like they always send me something like this. Oh, except this one's short sleeves. Usually they send me a long sleeve version. This is Kaylee. And it's kind of like a dark rusty pink and an off-white, those are the stripes. And it has a hood. That's cute. It's kind of similar to what I'm wearing now, except what I'm wearing now is long sleeves. Okay, let me try this one on. Okay, what do we think? I think it's cute. 
nice drawstring. It fits well. It's a good length. I mean, it's kind of long, but I like it that length. And yeah, I don't know. It's kind of cozy. I like that it's short sleeves because I honestly have a lot <laughs> of clothing items like this that are long sleeves. So it's nice. And then I have the hood. So if it's raining like it is right now, which you can't see, but it is raining, I could go out with my hood. Shall we move on? <laughs> Item number four. Oh, wow, I've never, I don't think I've ever received a skirt from them. And definitely not a black denim one. So that's cute, it's free people, which means it'll probably be really expensive. So stay tuned for that. So it zips in the back so that you can, oh wait, is that the back? Yes, it is the back. Okay, so it zips in the back and then this is the front. It is really cute. I like that it's black denim. I've been trying to find black denim jeans <laughs> for a long time and um, that's been unsuccessful. But I'm gonna wait to see the price of this before I make any decisions. And of course I have to try it on. Item number five, last item. Oh, shorts, okay. They seem like high-waisted, which is honestly not my favorite. It is from Can Can, K A N C A N. It's a light wash. So here they are. They kind of have the little fold up roll right here at the leg. And they have four buttons coming up. That's why I think it might be high-waisted, does it say? No, it just says distressed cuffed shorts. Interesting. So I have to try those on too. So let me insert the try-on part here. hooded knit top is $36. That's not bad. Okay. That's definitely on the cheaper end. So let's keep going. The jean shorts, which are the Can Can Distress Tack Cuffed Shorts in light blue. They're $44, which honestly isn't that expensive for really for any denim, but for shorts as well, so. All right, the Free People denim skirt is $50. Wait, that's like way cheaper than what I was thinking. Wow, okay. $50 is not bad at all for Free People. All right, the Lush Tie Front Crop Cami Blouse in Blue is $38 which again is really not that expensive. Um, and when I say that, you can check out my other Stitch Fix videos because in the past I've definitely received boxes where the items are all between like 75 and $120. And you know, I'm not really looking to spend that much money. So 
This is definitely a more affordable box. So thank you to stylist Rita for giving me affordable items. Okay, the most expensive, of course, is the dress, but that's okay. I mean, it's definitely the most material. So this is the Market and Spruce Raina Bell Sleeve. Oh, it's actually cut off. It, I think it's supposed to then say embroidered dress in coral. And, oh, coral, that's the color. It is $78. So, you know, that makes sense. Now I have to decide what to do. What items do I want to send back? I don't want to keep the whole box. I already know that. So now I just have to choose what items I want to send back. I should mention that if you do keep the whole box, you get a discount. So on here it says you get a 25% discount if you end up purchasing the whole box. And if you don't, like I don't think I will, then you have to buy the items individually. All right, so. <laughs> After doing some math and some thinking, I have decided what I'm going to do. Now, if I were to get the whole box, like I was saying before, it came out to be $183, which really isn't bad. So personally, I may have done that in the past because it's five really good items that may last me a long time. But because I just spent all my money on moving to this new apartment, I don't want to be too careless. So, although I really do like this skirt and I think it's a good price, I really don't have anything in my closet that I would wear it with. So, I think it would end up kind of just sitting in my closet and I would be like, oh, that's fun. Wish I could wear it, but I don't know what I would wear it with. So I'm going to pass on this. And this tank top I do think was really cute. However, I do find really good deals on sites like Depop and other places. So I really think I could find something very similar to this that wasn't, I think it was either 36 or $38, which again, I know isn't that much money, but I have to really be obsessed with something to want to spend money on it. I either have to be obsessed with it or feel like it's practical and both, and I don't feel either way for this item. So I'm going to pass. This item probably doesn't come to any surprise that I do want to keep it. I tried it on right away. I know it's kind of simple, but I actually think I'll be able to Bruce it up and I do think it's practical <laughs> so for those reasons I'm going to keep it okay the lovely dress I feel like people are going to be like oh my gosh why are you not keeping it but for $78 I honestly want it to fit perfectly again if I were maybe at a different stage of life and had $78 to just buy whatever and then maybe go get it fitted I would do that, but I have to think of priorities, so I don't really want to spend $78 on a dress that I feel like doesn't totally fit correctly. <laughs> Lastly are the jean shorts. So I ended up really liking them once I tried them on, and I'm also in need of better jean shorts. A lot of my shorts I've had for probably, to be honest, like a decade, and they're just not it anymore. <laughs> so I do need jean shorts, and I like light wash shorts. I know some people are not a fan of this color for denim in shorts, but I really like it So because they fit really well and they aren't that expensive. I am going to keep these shorts. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe. I have apartment updates and all of that fun stuff coming. So I will see you all very soon. Bye.